All right, I think I'm, I got a new microphone, guys, so hopefully it's uh, recording. Yeah, it should be picking up my voice then. But uh, I guess I'll find out when I uh, upload it. Got uh, a couple new mic microphones for like five bucks or so. Just a couple of simple ones. Um, at least this time I'll have an extra one in case uh, this one dies again, so that's good. Um, gonna be really careful today since we have some rain and the roads are pretty slick. Um, it's Monday the 16th of September. And, uh, yeah, you got to be careful driving when it's wet out, so. That dude was, uh, like a termite control dude, and he was passed out. He was taking a lunch and nap or something. Who knows what he was doing. That was funny. The guy was, like, si like sideways in his chair, like, passed out. <laughs> Mm -mm -mm. It's got the Monday blues. Susie Q. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Now, baby, Susie Q, now, baby, I love you. Susie Q. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I like the way you walk. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I like the way you walk. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I like the way you walk. I like the way you talk. Susie Q. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm pretty excited. Um, yesterday, sorry, just uh, ignore my singing. Uh, yesterday, I was at work, but I heard my Raiders won. I'm wearing my Raiders jersey, and uh, it's always been my team. They've never really been that good since I've liked them, so um, I started liking them when I was probably like five years old, maybe. Maybe even before that, I don't really remember. But uh, ever since they were like, they made it to the Super Bowl against New England one the year, I think. I was still pretty young. And uh, they lost. It might not have been the Super Bowl. It was like the AFC Championship game, something like that. But ever since then, I've really liked the Raiders. Even though I live in uh, close to Seattle. So a lot of people around here like the Seahawks. And they're pretty good. I mean, they have a chance to win the Super Bowl this year for sure. They uh, they just wall up the Giants, or the, the 49ers last night. So we'll see. I think this mic should work. It was brand new, so, you know. Uh, Finally got around doing that. I'm happy I bought a, I don't have it yet, I just bought it today. I bought a motorcycle jacket um, for like 80 bucks or something, so. Um, just because, as you can see, it's gonna be getting pretty cold here soon. Uh, we're already pretty much in the fall season now, and if it's not the summer here, it's not very nice, so. Too bad my riding, my riding in shorts and a t-shirt is, is pretty much over. You know, you take it for granted how nice it is here for you know two months or so, and then reality kicks back in, and you're like, oh shit. And you, your bike sits in the garage for a long time, and now it's raining, and I have to take it out in the rain. So if I don't take it out in the rain, I won't ever take it out. So. All right. Baby Susie Q. Oh, that's a little go kart there, dude. 100 bucks. Uh, probably not for the go kart. Those things are fun, man. I remember. Oh, but good memories driving those things lap after lap after lap at like a park with my brother and my whole family. So that's fun stuff. 
That wasn't like a, a speed cart though, that was kind of like a little buggy thing. So, the ones where you get a race against your pals, like K1 Speed or, or whatever it's called, where you get to have like a track, those are, those are fun. They go up to like 30 mile an hour too, just on really tight tra turns, so. I'm going 30 right now, I bet um, they, might, they might even go like 40. They're pretty fast. Baby Susie Q, girl, I love you. Susie Q. It's funny, like, in a couple months, this day will be like a good day, weather-wise. Isn't that kind of sad? Like, if the sun ever comes out here, it's usually like once every 10 days and, uh, you know, it's like 35 degrees out, so. Uh, I really do like it here when it's nice out. I really do, like I don't, I have no complaints. But when it's, uh, when it's eight months a year of this crap starts getting to you. Mm -mm -mm. Some people like this weather, and I, I don't know how they could like this weather. It's cold, it's, it's, uh, it's gloomy, it's cloudy, it's rainy, it's cold. I don't know, maybe because I like, the one thing I really like to do is ride my bike, and when I can't do that, I guess I'm in a worse mood. I'd be in a lot better mood if I could always ride, you know, like after work or after school. Always being able to hop on the bike and just go for a little ride. Um, and that's why I like the summer so much. Because you don't have to, you really don't have to worry about the weather. And, uh, you know, it's pretty warm out so you can, I know it's not really safe, but you can wear like a t-shirt and shorts. And uh, I haven't gone down yet, but I mean, once I get my jacket, I'll probably wear it all the time. But some days it gets up to like 85, 80, 85 degrees some days, and not often, but occasionally. And uh, wearing a jacket is just a lot, of, a lot of extra weight, a lot of extra heat. And I would wear it if I went on the freeway, but I usually just go, I usually just putt around town here. So, it serves that purpose fine. Susie Q, baby, I love you. This building's really coming along. I think it's only been three months or so. I think it's supposed to be like a Rite Aid or something, but that looks kind of like a library or library building to me. Baby Susie Q, baby, I love you. Susie Q. I was looking at helmets today because I got a jacket, but I'm fine with the one I have. Seriously, some helmets they want like nine hundred dollars, four hundred dollars. I got this one for like sixty bucks, and I'm I'm fine with it. It's just black. It's not the best helmet out there, I'm sure, but I mean, a helmet pretty much. As long as you're wearing a helmet, um, and this is a DOT helmet, so it's fine. But uh, I mean, some states don't even require you to wear a helmet, so. I don't think I could do that. I mean, my parents always told me to wear a helmet. I don't think I could consciously not ride a helmet every day. That would just be bad. Susie Q, the baby, I love you. Big news for me in my life. I quit my job here at the mall. Finally. Um, and I got a different job I'm working at a gym, so um, I don't know. 
I don't know how I feel about it. I mean, I'm happy to leave this place because I, it wasn't going anywhere, obviously. And, you know, just changing it up and something different is, uh, is kind of what I needed. Even if it's, I don't, it's not that much more money. Um, it is more money, but it's not that much more. But uh, I just needed to change the scenery. And for only a part time, it's, uh, it's a good little job. So, going to school and uh, working there like three days a week or something like that. Um, still have a little time to do some other stuff, so. Uh, that's how it should be. A little school, a little work, a little free time, a little homework. Although when the uh, when the summer's no longer here, it's I don't even know what I usually do. I do a lot less riding, that's for sure. And uh, yeah. I don't know. It's too bad that uh that the weather here is is like it is. Check out what's in here. Anyway, guys, I hope the audio works. Um, I did get a new mic, so it should be all right. Feel free to comment or like. And uh, let me know what you think. Thank you. You guys have a good day.